The last thing the Institute needs now is to make things worse. We should be trying to avoid conflict, not starting it. I would love to see that big airship fly off over the horizon. But it's not gonna happen. The conflict is already upon us. Unless we end it now, it's only going to get worse. We really don't have a choice. If we're to emerge from this the victors, we need to move quickly. As director, it's up to you and how we focus our efforts in achieving this goal. We'd like your input on what direction we should take. Do we increase synth production or fo focus on weapons development? Synths are the Institute's greatest strength. The more we have, the better off we are. Well said. I'll see that the necessary steps are taken. That's all we have for the moment. I believe Father wished to speak with you once our meeting concluded. As long as you respect our rules and policies, you might just succeed as our next director. Green... Uh, I mean, the, uh, the great green jewel of the Commonwealth. It's Diamond City Radio. Here's Frankie Carl with a song that, frankly, sounds a little too good to be true. I'm not saying he was embellishing. I, uh, but, uh, well, no, okay. I guess I am. Never mind. Here's uh, one more tomorrow. Remember Have you to seen J522 around? He didn't show up for minimum. duty today, and I can't Don't seem to recharge find him. Don't recharge. Did you check robotics? Primary levels. He was probably scheduled 2%. for routine maintenance. Also, if you haven't patched your navigation so too, software, but he wasn't in the log, so and everyone I've meeting. asked hasn't seen him. The last thing we He's need never just more. There you are. You've met with the director. I assume they made their intentions known? It was difficult for them to reach the decision to engage in open hostility. What about you? You agree with their decision? It's the only way we can ensure the Institute's safety. That makes it the right thing to do. I'm glad you agree. None what comes next will be easy. That conviction may help keep us all going. You know, Mother, it's no secret that you worked with the railroad in order to first reach the Institute. The depth of your involvement with them has been called into question repeatedly. I'm sure you can guess by whom. The question is, where do you stand with them now? Do you count them amongst your allies? They mean nothing to me. Never have. I'll admit, I'm relieved to hear that. Then I certainly hope I can count on you for what needs to be done. Because these fanatics cannot be allowed to continue to exist. They represent a very clear threat to the Institute. Small as they are in number, their twisted ideology ensures that they will never stop trying to strike at us. They must be eradicated. Are you willing to see to it? There has to be some other way to deal with them. Something less drastic. No, not the railroad. This is our only option. These people are zealots. They have continually shown no regard for human life in their bizarre crusade to free synths. They will not listen to reason, they will not accept reality, and so they must be destroyed before they can destroy us. Please, know that I take no pleasure in this. I have never been one to advocate violence. There is simply no other way. Can I count on you to do what needs to be done? I'll get rid of them. Thank you. The I realize this will be dangerous. Please try to stay safe. You have suspected that the Institute still exists. 
that we are among you. It's true. But it's not the whole truth. We if you require are here, maintenance, and please we file a report with the facilities division. Here to help. Our superior technology represents the future of the Commonwealth. Today, we activate our nuclear reactor, ensuring that we will persevere long after the world above ground ceases to exist. Ensuring that mankind has a future. We have no desire to interfere in the unimportant details of your personal freedoms. We simply insist that you do not interfere with Institute operations. To do so would result in dire consequences. Rest easy. Know that the future is in safe hands. And that mankind will thrive under our guidance. What the heck was that Institute guy talking about? The above world will cease to exist? I don't like the sound of that. Hey, I think those Volbra brothers are looking for you. Be sure to check every corner of Earl's house. You never know what kind of clues you'll find. Nick. Time to hit the road? You interested in traveling together? Sure. Could be fun. Let's head out. Well, all right. So, any stories you two come across out there? I get the exclusive, right? Piper, I wouldn't know who else to tell. Pearl couldn't have been taken by the Institute, right? Why would they want Earl? Hey. I'm all ears. Hey, Valentine. What do you need? Your thoughts? The detective's life isn't an easy one, but it rarely lacks for excitement. How are we doing, Nick? I guess things are all right. I just want to make things right for people out here. The dean at the department is the one is who reported feel the same. Missing. It might be worth talking to him. Oh, nothing. Got it. Even good people do crazy things when they're scared. Want to be Diamond City's motto. This radio station, um, well, uh, <laughs> well uh, you'll notice there aren't any other ones. So, uh. Travis. Hey, I mean, I mean, I mean, hi, again, uh, hi, hi. Don't, uh, don't, don't break my stuff if you, uh, if you don't. If you don't mind. Hey, 
Hanging out with Valentine, huh? Good for you. Take these good people. I know. Got a minute? Drinks on me. I assume you don't buy every stranger a drink. I'm in town looking for Henry Cook. Do you know where I might find him? Why are you looking for him? Fair question. He's my father. I haven't heard from him in a while, so I came to town to check up on him. I wish I could help you, but I don't know where he is. All right, thanks. I'll be around. I'd appreciate it if you let me know if you hear anything. Excuse me. When I want to talk to you, I'll let you know. Been to good neighbor? Friggin' hole. Holes and cameras all over. Yeah? Far too busy to talk right now. I'm the mayor, after all. 